Hey, what's up, everybody? Whoa. Welcome back to State of K Lifeline. Here we are. Well, we are kind of in the middle of Quietsville to a very, very small degree. I'm going to go ahead and queue up a few things here. We don't have a lot of food. We don't have a lot of, well, a lot of different stuff. And that's because I've been very cheap. We're getting a basic supply drop here, hopefully sometime in the very near future. We do have some meds, we'll do that, and we need to go out and get some supplies if you look on the map. Uh, Mission-wise, we have retrieved the intel, let's go ahead and do that. We're probably getting pretty close to a siege, but we're going to hopefully have some time before that has to happen. So, I uh, want to talk very briefly while I make this drive about the Year 1 Special Survivor Maximum Awesomeness Edition. Uh, what the plans are for Lifeline. Basically, long story short, I've played Lifeline a lot, and I still find it to be enjoyable. We have a playlist on the channel for all of the endings, I do believe, with the uh, exception being Sandbox. Oh, I thought that was a car up there. I was like, what? Um, with the exception being Sandbox. And Sandbox, we tried to do some of, and we had a lot of troubles with it. Um, I ran out of influence and basically ended the game. If I remember correctly, I may have even ended it with only one survivor. I, I don't specifically recall. So, what I figured for the Year 1 State of Decay, Super Awesome Edition, Survivor Edition, Amazingness, I figured I would probably go ahead and play the campaign through one more time, make sure that instead of focusing on completing the campaign for um, completion per se, that we would try to complete it, but we would focus more so on getting the uh, challenges done that I asked you all for and that you left in the various comment sections and such where, yeah, up here, okay. Hopefully that will kind of block the door for us. There we go. Glitching through. There we go. Uh, so yeah, that's my plans for Lifeline. I don't think we'll ever really... Uh, what's left? Oh. I don't think we'll ever really abandon Lifeline, but it may come to a point where it's just kind of like it is now, where we have... Uh, Maybe one or two uploads a week. Because I think that's fair. You know, Lifeline's very... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Lifeline's fun. I very much enjoy it. Ooh. And I want to continue doing it at least somewhat. So I think as long as we play State of Decay, we'll always have a little Lifeline. But once the Year 1 Edition comes out, we'll definitely play through to see all the new graphics and pretty stuff. Michelle Martin? The Army. Okay. Wow. Yeah, that's me. I'm but yeah, sure. let's go ahead and to. focus I, uh, on this now. Look, I know what you're thinking, and I swear we had no idea this was going to happen. Actually, um, should I talk to mm. a lawyer? If you can find one, you're more than welcome. Right now, we need to clean out this office. Can you help us find what we need? Of course. And you'll tell them I cooperated, right? Uh, just one last very, very, very quick note that I just I thought about. We will restart Lifeline whenever the Year 1 edition comes out, which I think is a little less than a month, so keep that in mind. All these people and all this stuff will go away, so in the next video or two we'll probably do some really fun stuff that's careless and not very smart, just so we have the fun. Ms. Martin, that's pretty much the only thing you want. Oh, right. Sure. Yeah. Here come the troops. Oh, miss. There we go. There we go. Go back to searching. We're fine. Okay, All right. That really is everything. I promise. Look, you're not going to take those documents without me, right? I mean, I can probably help you read them. Look, my orders probably. were just to bring back those documents, but yeah. I can't leave you here. Come on. Come on, she says. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <coughs> Gets off me vehiculars. Alrighty, everybody. Now that we did whatever that was, let's go ahead and go on home. We'll prepare for the siege. We need to make sure 
uh, we go back to what we started with this campaign that I was going to try to be a minimalist as much as possible. We do have 3,000 influence. We are getting a basic supply drop, which should help. But in the meantime, we really need to focus on minimalizing as much as possible. Uh, but long term, since we're going to be restarting, we are going to spend it all. But we just need to make it through one last siege being a minimalist. So let's see what we can get done. And since I have a civilian, I'm not going to make the jump, but we will make the jump, I do promise. I want to wait for the new graphics, though. Da -da 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 -da. Alrighty. Looking good. We're here. Stay near the landing zone until the helicopter gets As yeah. long as you don't do anything stupid, we'll keep you alive. Thank you. Just don't do anything stupid, she says, very casually. Alrighty, whom, if anybody, can... You have a revolver. Let's go ahead and give you the grenade. Ah, blah, blah. ah I don't know why it does that. kind of have troubles running whenever I switch to somebody. <clears throat> there we go. And flip back to you. I am encumbered. I understand. We're going to fix that. Store, store. I really hate to waste this suppressor. Do I have a better option? Oh, I could go sniping. Ha ha ha. Uh, for right now, we'll go ahead and we'll store that. And let's go ahead and grab some ammo. Store this ammo. Don't really want to use flames. We want pew pew and boom boom. So let's take that and... Alright, I think we're good and ready for the siege. We're burning through our influence and supplies, but it should be okay. I'm going to try not to use that grenade if I can. Like I said, I'm going to try to use as little as possible. Save as much as we can. Overall, though, if you look at the map, we're not doing awful. This is pretty much done. Uh, this has been touched deal with the rest of it here in a minute. Boom. 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 Contact. Contact. Three shots. Whoa. What the? How'd that happen? Is the door left open? randomly spawn inside. There should be a second siege wave, so I'm trying to be a little frugal on the... Um, really, Kilo? Really? Really? Trying to stand in front of me shooting. Uh-huh. No, nobody wants to get the last guy? There we go. Alright. Now we'll make a little boom boom. Boom boom. Noise. Boom. Oh, missed. Boom. So for the most part, I'm just kind of sitting here going boom. <laughs> They're pretty much look at Kilo. Go. Bam, bam, boom. I know. Save me, auto aim. Oh, that back door is open or something. It's not open. I just ran through it. Those. Cheaters. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> uh, it's one of the most amazing things of Lifeline, the siege modes. Level 4 cardio. Beautiful. Alright. Let me get up top here. We'll take a little bit of sniper shots. Fun. Alright, this is it. I 
Yeah, you know, just a mosquito shot. Don't worry about it. Yep, just mosquitoes, you know. They affect the zombies, too. Alright, this isn't doing very much. Not gonna continue to waste the ammo. One of them will kill it. I'm going to put the sniper rifle up, use the time, get a little bit of inventory sorted here. East gate is compromised! East gate is compromised! Yay! Oh, wait, that's bad. No! Sir, no, wasted it. Oh well, forgot all about that. At least everybody lived, though. That's good. I can tell by me not playing this as much because we've completed the campaign, so I'm starting to get rusty and not super amazing awesome like I used to be. At least I felt I was. But um, hopefully, whenever the year one edition comes out, we'll be okay. Right now, definitely got some rust. Hi, Road. This is Black Friday. We have Michelle Martin inbound with a stack of documents. There's plenty Safely of room on the landing pad, the Black Friday. Be ready for another extraction when we have the intel. Hi, Road. There we go. Oh, that was not weird at all. Alrighty. Well, everybody, we got some supplies. It's a little rough. We're going to go ahead and put this grenade back in. We will do a little bit of scavenging to finish out this video. Starting the next video, we are going to be spending influence to have all sorts of fun. All sorts of fun. We're going to go crazy and have a ball and make sure that all of this influence is spent before the year one edition comes out. Last thing I want to see is you get bored. <laughs> um, yeah, so we'll we'll, uh, we'll spend all this in the next couple of videos and have as much fun as possible. We're good there. We need a suppressor because I used up a lot there. And let's see. How to take care of that. Let's go ahead and get a materials drop, get that taken care of. We'll have to get ammo and all that sorts of stuff later. Uh, let's do potent homemade stems. No, box mine, yeah. Get the box mine researched. All right. We could do the Squatchians mission. Let's go ahead and actually do that real quick. You ready to hit out? Okay, I'll follow you. This will possibly be the last campaign type thing we do, and it will be the last campaign so, type thing we're going to care about. I hope you brought a Molotov or something. Otherwise, you're going to be useless as tits on a boat. If you ain't ready to burn a Zed, then let's turn around and get ready. We're ready. So yeah, well, this is going to be the last mission we're going to do for campaign-wise. The next few videos, like I said, we'll focus on maybe doing a campaign, or er, challenge or two, excuse me, and we'll focus on getting the fun stuff in. We'll, we'll spend all of our influence just getting weapons and camo and all sorts of things. And then I think for the final episode we will tear down all the uh, outposts. We'll go out and we'll get everybody killed off. And that will be the official ending to this campaign for Lifeline. And then we will restart it whenever we get to the Year 1 edition. So as far as I know we are in the beginning of April. I do believe, since I'm playing it on the PC, we'll get it towards the end of April, beginning of May, but I'm not 100% for sure. Let's see, searching for a screamer. Alright, Squatch, Squatch, let's do it. Boop. The exciting thing and fun thing will be- oh, the trash is Look at that. Seems to be a few physics-based problems in the game at the moment. The nice thing I was going to say about the year one edition is to be able to use Squatch in the breakdown campaign. Be pretty key. Alright. It's 
not going to be over here. This is going to be pretty tight quarters to try to burn them. Watch behind me. Nothing. The mini map <clears throat> kind of made it look like I was about to get eaten, but it is not the case. Alright. See if we can kind of get an angle going here. No. Time to move on. You led me on a false goose chase there, Squatch. Not too happy. get a move on here so yeah soak in the fact that everybody's alive and well because here uh, probably in about two or three videos everybody will not be we will kill them all off we will use up all the influence have all the fun and then restart this with the year one edition so I will no longer bother you all about repeating that anymore let's get back into the campaign uh, I want to drive the fire truck. Woo! That's not a screamer. Uh, there is a screamer though. I've got you now. Cook up like a marshmallow. No. Um. <laughs> Really? All right. No, no, I understand. Playing with fire seems dangerous when you're three fucking years old. Are you finished? We're all finished. <sighs> Shit together and start doing what I say. <clears throat> I think that was bug. That's kind of what I'm guessing, but uh. You know, since we're not going to be continuing with the campaign, um, let's actually go on home in this video. It will be mostly informative. We'll, we'll chalk it up to uh, an update video. And then starting next video, we will start with the crazy fun, everybody dying. It will probably stretch out over two, three videos, and we'll continue from there because I really don't need to complete uh, the Squatch's mission since we're just going to be killing everybody off. So let's go ahead and go on in here. I'll get me a quick med and whatever little bit of fire I have left, which is not much. Quick med and I don't even think I have any MREs. That's awful. The, the, the resources are just so low. So very low. All right. Well, everybody, we got some stuff coming in. We'll have to wait on that. But for now, I'm going to end it. And like I said, we'll kill everybody off. We'll have fun. And then we'll restart Lifeline with Year 1 Edition. So thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more stuff in the future. And have a good day.